news tonight. A deadly crash in the Sepulveda Pass. At least one person was killed. Three others hurt. Two have life-threatening injuries. Well, here at home, big waves are pounding the shores as a high surf advisory takes over Southern California beaches. We have team coverage for you tonight, beginning with the KKL9 Orange County reporter Michelle Geely, who checked out conditions in Newport Beach. Well, now add another name to that list, but this one you probably have never heard of. KKL9's Louisa Hodge shows us who wants to buy the team now. A yearbook photo might get a Colorado high school senior voted most likely to spark controversy. Tonight, a Good Samaritan is being honored by Garden Grove Police. Alex Ruiz helped fend off a couple of robbery suspects who beat up a convenience store clerk. KKL 9 Stephanie Abrams tells us those two suspects are still on the loose. Well, this isn't the first time Ruiz has stopped teens from getting away with beer. He says he faced a similar situation last month in El Segundo, but those teenagers didn't put up a fight. In the Inland Empire are going after parents who don't make sure their children go to school. KCAL 9 Inland Empire reporter Greg Mills spoke to one woman who was arrested because her children were truant too many times. Practically every bone in a four-year-old boy's face is crushed tonight because of a TV. A lot of women cut back on alcohol when they learned it could increase their risk for breast cancer. Well, now a new study suggests one type of alcohol in moderation may actually lower the risk. KCAL 9's Edward Lawrence shows us the research. 60. That explains mm. so much. It does. All right, actress Drew Barrymore, excuse me while I fix my mic, uh, is getting married again. Ha, ha, um, ha, 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 you could have ha, at least put a mustache or something. The, right? Um, yeah, it was just a little too obvious. Yeah. I think. You know, a lot of moms would rather uh, their sons and daughters go to church than go to the tattoo.